Hi, it's Wendy Hernandez, attorney and creator of Command the Courtroom. One of the most common questions I get from people is whether or not child custody can change once, once a judge makes a decision. So um, let me break that down into two different parts. As you may or may not know, there's two parts to custody. There is the legal custody aspect of child custody, and then there's the physical aspect of child custody. Legal custody refers to who gets to make major decisions for the children, and physical custody refers to how much parenting time each parent is awarded or exercising. So a lot of times people are hesitant to enter into certain custody or uh, parenting time arrangements, but by custody, I mean legal custody, sole versus joint custody. And they ask me, well, you know, if this doesn't work for me or, or our children, can this be changed? And the answer is yes, child custody can be changed. And it can be changed even if a judge is the one who issues, issued orders in your case after a trial. But there are certain requirements that you're going to need to meet before it can be changed unless the other party agrees to the change. So the requirements are going to depend on where you are. But generally speaking, you're probably going to have to show the judge that there's been a substantial and continuing change in circumstances, or for some reason, the current arrangement is not in the best interest of your child. So for example, in Arizona, um, a person can't ask the court to change um, a custody arrangement for at least one year after an order is entered. And one year isn't just the magic number. You still have to show that there's a change in circumstances. Now, there are exceptions to this one year requirement in Arizona, and I would encourage you wherever you are to see if there's a requirement, a minimum an, uh, amount of time that you have to wait before you can ask the court to change custody. But there's, there's exceptions. So say, for example, you know, um, you find out the other parent is doing drugs or there's been a significant domestic violence incident or the other parent gets arrested or put into jail or prison. Um, those may be reasons why the judge could modify custody um, shortly after the judge enters an order. So number one, you have to <clears throat> look at your state rules or your country rules wherever you are and figure out what the requirements are to change custody, um, legal custody or parenting time. And number two, you have to figure out whether you can meet the requirements. But the long and the short of it is, is that children's needs change after time, especially, you know, after they start getting bigger. And the law provides for custody arrangements to be changed over time. Your job is to convince the judge that the arrangement you're asking for is in the best interests of your children. So I hope this helps as always. Give it a thumbs up if you liked it. Pass it on to anybody that you think might need it. Um, subscribe to the YouTube channel to get the weekly videos that I put out. Also like us on Facebook. Check out commandthecourtroom.com for um, other information you can get about your case. Until next week, keep on trucking and remember to command the courtroom. <music>